Hey there, everybody. Um, so, as a, a bit of a follow-up to Stasis, I decided to check out another game by the same developers. I think it's along the same stories. Obviously, the name of the corporation is the name of this game, which is Kane. Um, there's a baby in the background. Uh, from what I understand, it does still take place on the same ship. I don't know if it's a prequel, if it's prequel, prequel or a sequel. <clears throat> or if it's any of those, uh, there's an X here. I'm guessing it also does the same thing as Quit the Desktop. Obviously, if you click on More Adventure Games, it tells you about Stasis. So, the thing is, this is free, uh, this one. So, that's why I don't know if it's supposed to be a prequel to set up, you know, set the story up for Stasis. Um, but it did. it was developed after Stasis, if, if I am correct. So, I figured let's give it a shot. It's it's supposed to be pretty short. I think um, I checked on, uh, there's a time to beat. I forget what the name of the website is, but you could actually check to see how long typically it takes games to beat. And this one was about two and a half to three hours. So, this should only be, you know, a, a few episodes or so. <clears throat> um, so, we'll see how it goes. Uh, I think you play as a, a lady in this one. So, we'll see. And again, this is free. So, this is kind of almost their advertisement in a, in a sort of sense for this is supposed to entice you to buy stasis i would guess sarah ann williams Ugh. ryan cooper we don't see the bischoffs oh there they are Crystal Bischoff. I wonder if she's a sister or a wife of one of them. I could look it up, but I'm not going to. And then we got Nicholas Bischoff. <clears throat> and it was created by the Bischoff brothers. They have the Seinfeld theme for some reason. She's got a very twitchy face. Not sure what's going on there. I don't want a child. Uh-huh. I've never wanted one. I, I had a plan, and this oh. wasn't part of it. We're on Relax. a planet. I promise this won't hurt like, a bit. How would he know? <laughs> Thanks. Just a few more items to check off, and we can start. Ooh, there's a child. Name and ID? Hadley, 14-0-31-21-09. <laughs> And the procedure is being paid for by a third party? Yes. <clears throat> they no explanation needed. No family listed? No family. Uh-oh. It's just me. That's going to get you a special order here. Ah, that's for me. Right then. Let's begin. Nurse. Now, count back from ten. And again, make me do <sighs> surgery on myself, like ten, the other one. Nine. You'll be just fine, sweetie. Eight. Seven. Okay. Uh oh. So, okay. <laughs> it's like they have this very creepy kind of title here, but so far you've not had any reason to believe that it would be creepy. It could just be a birthing simulator. You never know, right? Going into this blind. <laughs> Quick time events. Oh, holy shit. That was a big fella. Oh God. Where am I? What did you do to me? Uh-oh. <laughs> Oh, Jesus. Why would they make the room so fucking, like... <laughs> like, if you're Kane Corporation, why not... Why would you put someone through this if you knew they had to be awake? Why not make it, like, a sterile environment? 
where without like this weird giant thing Help me. stomping Help around me. like why would you want it <laughs> i can't do anything a thing popped up for a moment is it is that supposed to be like a padded room or something but it doesn't sound like it the way he's walking but it looks like it's padded am i meant to do something I don't know. I don't have a cursor. Beginning fetal no. Okay. Preaching. Ooh. What? What's happening? What are you doing? Answer me! God damn it! Fucking answer me! Uh oh. What are you gonna do to me? Okay, we gotta grab the scalpel. Please. Oh lord. Now use the scalpel to cut this. Uh, to cut myself. To cut him. Clearly I gotta use the scalpel, right? Yeah, there we go. What is that thing? Why is it like some organic looking fucking thing? Complete. Subject no longer present. Fetal extraction canceled. The blood looks a little Still too glowy. Fetal extraction? This is all because of the baby? Hey, you're a smart one. Okay, do we still have the scalpel? No, but we do have data records. Um, so that's great. What do you mean it's not right? You. Weren't you, weren't you trying to get pregnant or something? I thought, maybe? No? Maybe not? Okay. Is it the, the interface is a little bit different. Interestingly enough. Oh look, this is all... Looks a little bit better. Happy Mother's Day! Diagnostics. Software updated. Removal of uterus without... Uh-huh. Failures. There's a bunch of failures after... Um... Was it supposed to be the year 19? I don't know what this year this is, is supposed to be, if that's even this the year. Dr. Adams calibration. Yeah, 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 all this stuff. Program. Okay, so everything's engaged. Oh, no valid target selected. I, okay. So we gotta get out of this? How do I get out of this? Oh, this? Yeah. Interesting. She will run, which is nice. <clears throat> I think it looks nicer than uh, Stasis so far. Okay, so this is the arm scanning control. Scan complete. Uh, Subject no longer present. Lifeless Hulk. Fetal extraction canceled. Well, just you gave sweatly around the scalpel now stuck at his vertebrae. The pungent green gas escapes from a severed breathing apparatus. Interesting. Um, am I? Am I, am I supposed to like use the data records on the terminal, maybe? No? Maybe this one? No? Okay. Wow! First room and I'm already stuck. Great. Um, there's black metal struts and, and a holographic display. It seems like... Am I... Arm... Valid just gestate targets only. But when I try to do the arm scan control, it just scans this area. And then there, and this one tells me there's no... When I try to engage, it says there's nobody. And this is just diagnostics. Arm. Engage. No valid target selected. What? Oh no. Am I stupid? I must be stupid. What? Uh, what am I missing here? Do I need to? Do I need to? Scan my arm and then run over? It worked. Ah. Subject in place. Feet is ready for extraction. There we go. Okay. So then, I now need to engage it. Extraction process. Breathe, Hadley. Breathe. What does that do for me, though? Okay, so it cuts. It. Oh, why? What? Why would it pick him up? I don't understand.
understand that. Why would the computer pick that thing up? And then... What? Oh, she's weird looking. She never closes her mouth. That blood is still... Oh! Um... Okay. Sure. <laughs> Why not? <laughs> yeah, fire detected. Oh, there I am. On my stomach. Probably shouldn't be. Oh, we've uh, unlocked an achievement already. That's good. I really should turn those off when I'm recording so that those don't pop up all the time, but that's fine. Gotta get out of here. Oh, darn heckin' we do. All right, wait, we got an empty void. There's a fire. I mean, we can, uh... What must I do? Oh, there's a there's an action here. Oh, am I dead? Did I just kill myself? No, nope. no, I was about to do that. Falling on my stomach again. How is this child gonna survive this? Could have been a good thing for me a few months ago. I mean, it still oh, might. Uncalled for, Hadley. Funny, but uncalled for. What? How would the? No, you, okay, whatever. Um, are we gonna get our uh, thing back? Our scalpel? Yeah, oh, it's mangled now though. Scalpel, did I say scalpel? It's not even a word. There's an overhang here. Um, make sure I'm not missing anything. Doesn't appear that I am. The art style, it does look a little bit different, like, and the animations look a bit different for this, for the character. It, it does look better than Stasis so far, from what I can tell. And I don't think we're on the Groom Lake or, or whatever anymore. Uh, or at all. I don't know where we are. Just one of that Kane's like fucking thing. Maybe uh, stabbing that oaf wasn't such a bad thing. What the fuck? Hey, I recognize this music. This music, uh... Is one of um, what's his faces? Uh, ah, damn it! I used I use I used to use music all the time. Um, that that little bit of music that was what we, we used to use that for brute force's entrance uh, for the Let's Cross the Wrestling League. Um, oh, it's driving me crazy that I can't remember his name because I uh, uh hold on, it's like McLeod or something. Kevin McLeod. I think that's what it is. Anyway. Oh, boy. What's going on with this? Um, atmospheric control system. Activate PDT. Uh-oh. Well, we don't think we have an active PDT. There's suspended human remains up above. Um, some melted cac cacks. Wax candles. Everywhere. That doesn't even look like human remains, though. It looks like a, um... Because of the way that the, uh, the, the joints are, it, it almost looks like a, a dummy or something. There's a sealed tin of protein powder. Mmm. Sounds good to me. Give ourselves some nice protein. It's so dark. What? Oh. Hello? Who's there? What? It's dark in here. It sounds like, what's his face? I can't see anything. I, I can't see you. Who are you? What? Why can't I see? What's happened to my eyes? Where are- God. What is that feeling? My hands. My feet. My fucking skin. I found some spares. What? Nothing. Bad joke. Where am I? Okay, okay. Keep calm. Was I- Was I in an accident? No. I, th I think I can smell blood. Well, uh, uh oh. I'm Hadley. I I can't. Can't remember my name. Uh huh. Can't remember. I remember your it'll voice though. You. I'm sure it'll come back to you. Is he? Hello. Is he the suspended corpse? <laughs> I don't. It's dark, but. I can hear muffled noises. I can hear my toes. Guess not. Speak Where'd up, go? buddy! 
Is he in the fucking vents? I, what? On again. Well, as alone as I can be with a kiddo inside me. Okay. Anyway, um, am I supposed to do something goofy like use this on this to? Yep. Um. All right, eat it. Mmm. Give it to. Give it to the corpse. No. Fluid stained altar. No. Uh, we got some omni. Okay, let's let's look at this real quick. Stop. Oh, I can actually use that? Access to no, of course not. So everything else is sealed and locked. We need to do something with this atmosphere control system, but we don't have a PDT. Do I want to just dump this on it? Crying out loud, what was I thinking? Oh, I don't know. Um, pour it on the Omni toolbox. <laughs> hey. Ain't nobody got time for this. What? What is that voice? Ain't nobody got time for this. What, what the fuck is that? Oh, I don't know if I like this main character. Okay. Um. Let's see. The fuck do I got time to do? Uh, crudely stitched together with some monstrous meat marinette. Okay, so it is um meant to be as a crucifix. Kane Co Corporation has gone way off the deep end here. I mean, so so in Stasis, uh, if this is a sequel, which I'm assuming it is because it's implying that the guy from the first game is in this one and he doesn't know what's going on, his memory's gone, which he would have probably addressed in Stasis if that all that happened. Who knows? But anyway... And that one, the Kane Corporation just had like it was like just one guy that you know, yeah, they they had kind of nefarious things, but it was just one guy that went off the deep end and made some hybrid characters. This is just outright occult and stuff. You had some big beefy dude and like some weird thing coming down to take fetuses out. Now you got this guy on a crucifix. What's going on? And this and I don't know what ship or what we're on, and I don't know what we're doing here because I've only got data records and an opened protein powder container um there's melted wax candles i don't think i could do anything with the any of this yeah i can't do anything with anything all these are sealed it won't open they won't budge etc this i have no access for <laughs> am i supposed to be able to bring down this crucifix or what can I even do I hmm clearly I have to do something with this atmosphere control terminal but it won't let me because I have no access some bug or whatever likes human arms it looks like yeah there's nothing here there's nothing I can do here. I have no PDT. I'm, I don't know if this thing has a PDT, but I don't know how to get to it. Because all I have is a fucking open, 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 open pro, uh, protein power container. Do I have to go back? Maybe I have to go back with this pro, pro, protein power now. <laughs> I mean, there's no other thing I can do. Okay. I guess. Breathe, Hadley. This must be a side effect. You're still asleep. I would think so. It's kind of weird otherwise, wouldn't it? Um, sharp bladed pincher. Do I need that? <laughs> can't reach. Okay, so you can't reach that. I can get on this overhang though, right? Yep, I can go back up. Okay. <sighs> Interesting. We got the crushed computers. Oh, there's a PDA right here. Oh no, we gotta do some reading, it looks like. Oh boy, here we go. Now we're gonna get to learn something. Oh, look at this! This is this is an improvement. Ew, gross. Okay. Oh man, her fucking thumb's all fucked up. Alice, it's just from Hank, so this is the dude that we killed. Uh, Alice is sick, clumps of her hair were falling out while I brushed it before her bedtime story last night, and this morning she was listless and pale and leaky. Mother says 
the food in the facility is bad, and just to be safe, I've started feeding her protein powder from my own stash. But I think it's something. Uh, I think it's something in her IV lines. We pump a lot of unregulated experimental chemicals through the hosts, and maybe their blood has become contaminated. I need to find a new source, perhaps a sample from the brood. My sister's health trumps being uh, getting busted snooping around the uh, Kern's measurine measure measure manager managerine manager i can't ever say that word again and i need to resupply my blood uh, brood gas canisters anyway besides the opportunity for scientific research like dr adams would quirp quirp quip oh god guys i picked a bad day to read didn't i you know what i'm saging i don't get it but i laugh anyway i i don't get it either mother says i need to laugh at jokes or people will think i'm creepy i've decided to uh, make a list of behavioral prompts and appropriate, uh, appropriate responses because this social stuff can get complicated. Uh oh. Here we go. Behavioral prompts say, laugh, someone makes a joke. Blame Joseph if someone else complains that body parts are going messy from the bio waste disposal units or blame one of the cane techs instead. Three? Question mark. Lucy is responding to the new treatment. Lucy is Alice. Al was Alice. I think the uh, name suits her better since she got her new face last week. She looks more like Lucy now. We had an intern once named Lucy. She had the same freckles on her nose. That was before, though. The other me, when I was much older. It's confusing. Yeah, no shit. I've asked Dr. Adams about that, and he explained that because of the accident. My memories are not always re reliable. So, it's possible I dreamed of that part of uh, her subsequent vivisection. But the screams and the tears. And the way her organs gleamed in the surgical light seemed so real. And more than a bit erotic, I'll admit. Oh, God. So this guy's a fucking whack job, or was, until we stabbed him in the spine, apparently. Um, uh, one interesting, if somewhat unexpected, consequence of the new blo uh, blood transfusion source is that Lucy now uh, excretes a mus muscle substance, and not entirely dissimilar in effect to the brood gas. Uh, oral ingestion certainly produces a comparable anal uh, analgesic, anal analgi allergic, analgi anal 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 gesic anal response i have started scraping it off her skin and storing it in the specimen jars because mother says licking my own sister is quote improper number three here we go don't lick your sister whatever but now i carry it around with me and use it when the pain becomes too much so it's also more practical this way okay i gotta blow my nose it seems like that's gonna be the pattern uh when i play these games now is just blowing my nose and the inability to fucking read Huh. Work has been very busy. Two batches of hosts had to be terminated ahead of schedule due to the series of malfunctions with mother's product viability, uh, yeah, evaluation chip. There's been a lot of engineers and cleaners in and out of the lab, so I've moved Lucy from the storage closet to the atmospheric control room for now. My reputation around the facility is problematic enough already, and I don't need someone finding her and making things even worse. Mother says they wouldn't understand. There's also so much space... There's also much more space in the atmospheric control room. So, oh God, so that's Lucy. Ugh. So as soon as I've resolved the issues with her left leg, I think I'll teach Lucy how to do the waltz. I've been reading about uh, maggot therapy for treating necrosis, and a sample of Kern's uh, larvae recently turned up in the lab. Time for more scientific research. The arm chip failures that have made Dr. Adams even more anxious than usual. And today, wait. The arm chickers have made, sorry. And today I heard him talking, uh, asking Joseph about regularities in the lab security access log. I've seen Joseph lurking around the lab with a woman late in the night sometimes, but he told Dr. Adams he doesn't know anything about it. Dr. Adams believed him because he believes everything Joseph tells him. Or maybe Dr. Adams just doesn't want Joseph to get into such trouble for some reason. The way he so obviously ignored Joseph's uh, extracurricular activities with the host, for example. Oh, he's really protective of the man. God damn. Okay. I had to amputate uh, Lucy's left leg last night. Although the maggot therapy showed some superficial improvement initially, the necrotic progression was apparently already too advanced, and parts of the limb started to liquefy. What a mess. We've got a new batch of hosts fresh from Kane family planning to prep for second stage product incubation this week, so I should be able to find a more suitable or find a suitable replacement donor. The problems with Mother have persisted on and off, however, and she says the engineers want to wipe and reinstall her operating system. Oh. 
Interesting. I can't allow this to happen. What if mother doesn't love me anymore? What if she forgets me? Had Haley is sick again. Oh, Haley is Lucy. Used to be Lucy. I've decided to call her Haley now because I saw the name on the host file, and I think it's on a host file, and I think it's uh, really pretty. The host is really pretty too. So was her left leg. Oh fuck, they're gonna take my left leg. Anyway, I suspect that Haley's uh, Hadley's new illness is related to the fungus that's contaminated the air vents all over the facility. So you got the fungus again. I'm wondering if we are on the Groom Lake or not, which means a total lockdown at this level. Her mouth and nostrils are clogged with a slimy substance, and lung biopsy revealed a startling but impressive range of uh, my mycotoxin, mycotoxin, of un unknown taxonomy. 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 Several of her teeth are falling out, and her mus uh, mucosal excretions smell like an ammonia. I know I'm saying some of these words wrong, guys. Just fucking deal with it. Between this and the recent incidents with Mother, I've been thinking about an escape plan. Getting Haley and Mother to an elevator will be difficult, though I could, uh, th though it could be difficult, though, and even if I could, my lack of a PDT won't allow escape. Okay. Jesus Christ, that was an ob obnoxious, because I'm obnoxious. Uh-huh. What's this control terminal gonna tell me now? I think it's gonna be the same thing, right? Yes, locked out due to security event. Oh. Uh oh. So, this is a puzzle, I guess. Uh, maybe we could find that out somewhere. How, what I need to do with that, but we do have nothing, uh, actually. Um, there's fire down below. I, I can't reach that knife in uh, order to do something with it and uh everything's gone to hell so anyway uh let's look at this pda real quick maybe there's a there's a, a code on it written on it somewhere like off to the side or some shit no there's not hank hank can't help me no he's dead anyway all right guys well hopefully you've somewhat enjoyed this um it is a little bit different than stasis we don't we still don't know where we are exactly in the world of the Kane corporation but the Kane corporation seems to have gone completely off the deep end com just totally or this was all hank it could just be all hank too um again i don't quite understand what it is with the Kane corporation in making all of their uh labs and rooms look as creepy as they possibly can i would imagine if you were a corporation you'd want a very sterile environment for these kinds of things um, and it would just look like a normal hospital. But I understand that that doesn't make that great for a horror game so much. So, anyway, thank you guys for watching. And we'll be back next time with more Kane.